She's the woman of your desires, but you can't have. She's the sexy Minerva Mink of the Animaniacs. Minerva Mink made her debut on the Animaniacs in 1993 in episode 25, titled Hercule Yakko, a parody of Agatha Christine stories, but would not receive her own cartoon short until almost a year later in February 15, 1994, titled Meet Minerva. More messages? Ho hum. Hi, uh, Minerva, this is Lawrence. I'm a titter. Um, I, I was wondering, do you want to go out with me? Bye. I don't think so. Dead gum, my neighbor, this is foul mouth. And dead gum, Charlie is out of town for the dead gum weekend. Poultry. Ew. Hi, this is Trudy, your best friend. Um, my cousin is in town, and I told him you could, you know, show him around. I'd rather chew aluminum. He'll be over at five. Bye. A moment of silence for my former best friend. Minerva Mink's personality is snobby, materialistic, in vain, and her claim to fame is causing all males around her to explode in acts of lust just by walking by. <laughs> Minerva Mink was also famous for her sexuality. In case you didn't know, the 90s was notorious for sneaking in adult themes that would go above children's heads, just like Betty Boo in the 1930s. Boys! Can a girl get any privacy? Did we miss something? Let's take another look. Excuse me, Mink. I have decided I do not want to trap you at all. Your fur is not up to my standards. No, you do not interest me at all, little substandard Mink. You are cute. Wait, something's wrong here. Fans loved her, but censors could not stand her. In fact, before Meet Minerva was over, the antics would continue, when Minerva gives Newt a hug and it seemed as if he was penetrating. I can't believe it! How did you know that I wanted my house moved right next to the pond? Thank you, thank you. Minerva will return once more in July 2nd, 1993 of episode 30 with her second cartoon titled Over the Moon, where she is somewhat censored for her cleavage. I suppose I could wear something sleek and scandalous. Ooh, I'd like that. And I suppose we'll take a long romantic walk under the starlight. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. <laughs> Probably cuddle up close and cozy Ooh. and whisper sweet nothings in your ear. Oh, yes, 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 yes. Well, not in this life, Bob. Inspired in one more shower scene. <laughs> Outside a few comic appearances and her cameos in other cartoon character shorts. Over the Moon would be her last solo cartoon because she was deemed too sexual and a bad role model for young girls. Her legacy is now remembered mostly through fan art and fan created games. Thanks for watching. I suppose that'll do.